Hello, welcome to Mama Sue's Kitchen. I'm going to show you a sandwich today that I love. I got this sandwich idea from visiting our son and his family in Louisiana. And uh, my son's mother-in-law took her daughter and me to a, a cafe there and she said this is a sandwich she loves. Well, I don't know exactly how they make it, but I'm gonna do my best to replicate it. And I'm gonna start off with a slice of smoked provolone cheese. I apologize for my voice. I've had some sinus crud, but anyway, I hope you can understand me. Now, on this, I'm gonna put some canned fig preserves. And then, I have sliced a Granny Smith apple very thinly. And then I'm going to put a slice of Swiss cheese on the other side. Now you can put any kind of cheese that you would like. I'm pretty sure theirs had goat cheese, but I know that it had figs and it had Granny Smith apple. So I have my skillet hot And I'm going to do uh, butter, softened butter on one side. When I put it on here, I'm going to put butter on this side. I hope I didn't have it too hot. Maybe I didn't. But y'all, this was such a good cheese, grilled cheese, and they um, served it. It's a little hot, I'll tell you. They served it with the best side salad. Oh, it's just a little different than a real grilled cheese sandwich. And the uh, big preserve scape gives it just a little uh, sweet taste and the apple. Now I'm gonna turn this down and I'm gonna make another one because that one got real hot. <clears throat> but let me get my knife and I'm gonna slice it. See the apple, and the cheese, and the figs. Y'all, that is a delicious, delicious sandwich. Didn't take long to make at all. You can serve grilled cheese with anything you want. I know sometimes I'll have tomato soup. Sometimes I'll just have chips. But I just wanted to show you a quick way you put any kind of jam on it, but put you a little uh, Granny Smith apple and two kinds of cheese and let me know how you like it. I hope you'll remember to be salt and light wherever you go. Jesus loves you. And thank you so much for sharing my page and following me here and home with Mama Sue. I'll be back soon.